Yeah, you probably watch Glitch Tail in so in look at the interesting font they they used. You wondering how do I get this? So I mean, yeah, this is totally something for PC players. You wondering how do I get this? Get this font inside of Adobe Animate because there's no tutorial for how to get custom fonts in Adobe Animate. So yeah, I'll show you how to get this font. All you have to do is go to fonts and uh, look up. All you have to do is just click this font and, and all you have to do like select so you can change the size of it. All you do is just download family. And you see this, all you do is just, even though I already got it downloaded. Like so, I have to do is just extract the file. I do is just extract, like extract the file. So and uh, it's already like once you extracted it, all you have to do is just double click and you'll see this TTF. Like and all you have to do is just double click it and then press install. All right then, like so it may say I already got it. Yes, and then press yes, like, so there might be like this, this, this like, installing one out of one thing, like, and once you, uh, yeah, and once you got it installed, you don't need to restart your PC, all you have to do is create a new project. Oh, thank God, why is this so slow? I do is just create a new project and choose whatever resolution. Yeah, uh, once a dough. Like, oh, trust me, like that thing legit took so long to open. Cody, King, Blake, Royce, Roach. Like, that took so long. Like, so, it, all you have to do. Like, like, the, the, like the default font. Oh, so like the default font might be this one. Yeah, uh, like, yeah, uh, like, Nero UI. That, that might be the default font. All you have to do is just scroll up and you'll see. Press, yeah, uh, press start to okay. So, and there you go. If you're confused, I'll try to give you guidance on what you did wrong or why did it not work for you. So, so and that's how you get this font. Yeah, the classic Undertale font. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.